Now let me show you how the count and auto count functions work on your DigiRoller Plus. You'll notice that the count button is right here by your thumb, so while you're walking along measuring, you can be counting things. and It'll show here in the display the count will advance for things like drains or posts or ramps or whatever you might be counting. Now the way you clear the count is you just press delete count, clears that. The other function is the auto count function up here and that's for automatically counting reoccurring things like expansion joints in sidewalks or fence posts every 8 feet or sprinkler heads every 12 feet, whatever it is you might be counting a lot of over the course of a measurement. So the way you set that, let's set it for say 4 feet, 4 feet 6. Set auto count. And now it's flashing. Do I want to do it in feet and inches? Yeah, that's fine. So I'll hit yes with set. Now I'll hit the M plus key four times to get to four feet. Hit set. And now let's go six inches. Four. Okay. Hit set. So now that's set. So now let me just clear the display and let me just simulate a roll here. And you see every time I go past four feet six inches it beeps and counts one more here. So we've counted five of those increments. Uh, another handy use of this feature is if, say, you wanted a parking lot stripe every eight and a half feet, set it for eight and a half feet, and while you're going along measuring, it'll beep, and you know at that point to put a mark down, put a spray mark down. Same thing for athletic fields. So that's a quick overview on the count and auto count functions. For more details, you can download our user guide at www.calculated.com support.